hello student welcome to learn more math today we are going to learn about similar triangles part 10 so problems are related to areas of similar triangles so see student before going to watch part 10 you must watch part 8 and part 9 in part 8 we have discussed about statements of areas of similar triangles in the part 9 we have done some problems related to the areas of similar triangles i will provide the links in the description student you must watch those two parts then you have to watch this so student to get more updates you must subscribe to my channel learn, learn more mass so now see student these two are the continuation of problems related to areas of similar triangles so in the first pro first problem and second problem we have discussed in the part 9 so now third problem and fourth problem now we are going to discuss in part 10 so see student what kick has given in the third problem the areas of two similar triangles are 81 centimeter square and 49 centimeter square respectively if the altitude of the bigger triangle is 4.5 centimeters find the corresponding altitude of the smaller triangle so see student uh, solution how can we find the solution so area of the bigger triangle he has given student uh, area of the bigger triangle area of the bigger triangle so let it is uh, for our convenient let it is capital a1 student it is how much 81 centimeter square so next area of the smaller triangle area of the smaller triangle area of the smaller triangle let it is a2 student capital a2 he has given it is 49 centimeter square and also he has given altitude of the altitude of the bigger triangle he has given student altitude of the bigger triangle altitude of the bigger triangle so let it is a capital x1 student he has given it is 4.5 centimeters and we have to find the altitude of the smaller triangle so let the altitude of the smaller triangle be let the altitude of the smaller triangle b let the altitude of the smaller triangle be x2 centimeters so see student uh, this is related to the third statement of areas of similar triangles so he has given lengths of the sides so the area the ratio of the areas of two similar triangle is equal to the ratio of the squares of their altitude so so here we can write uh, a1 by a2 is equal to x1 square divided by x2 square so a1 how much student a1 he has given 81 divided by 49 is equal to x1 square is 4.5 whole square by x2 square so first for our convenient of am writing so by cross multiplication student 81 into x2 square is equal to 4.5 whole square into 49 so now we have to find x2 square is equal to 4.5 whole square into 49 divided by 81. So applying square root on both sides we can get x2 is equal to 4.5 into square root of 49 is 7 square root of 81 is 9. So 4.5 once and 4.5 two so 7 by 2 which is equal to 3.5 centimeters therefore the altitude of the smaller triangle is 3.5 centimeters student the altitude of the smaller triangle is 3.5 centimeters so next to fourth problem student uh, what he has given c triangle abc is similar to triangle def and their areas are 64 centimeters and 121 centimeters square respectively so if ef is equal to 15.4 centimeters then find bc so he has given these two are similar triangles and he has given the areas so he has given the areas are 64 centimeter square and 121 centimeter square respectively so that means here what he has given in the same order we have to take so first abc area triangle abc has given so first one 64 so 
area of triangle ABC is 64 centimeter square area of triangle DEF is 121 centimeter square that means that is the respectively in the what he has given first in the which order he has given we have to take in the same order so if EF is equal to 15.4 centimeter then find BC so C student uh, solution how can we find the solution so C, e, B, C and E, F are the lengths of the sides of uh, two similar triangles. Uh, so it is related to the first statement. The area of the, the ratio of the areas of two similar triangles is equal to the ratio of the squares of their corresponding sides. Uh, so we can write uh, area of triangle ABC. Area of triangle ABC divided by area of triangle D, E, F. Triangle D, E, F is equal to. So C student uh, here he has given EF is equal to 15.4. So in DEF triangle EF is last two letters. So EF corresponds to BC. We have to take last two letters. These two are corresponding. If he gives AB, DE. AB and DE are the corresponding. AC and DF are the corresponding. EF and BC are the corresponding. So C student area of triangle ABC by area of triangle DEF is equal to BC square divided by e f square so now we have to substitute the values area of triangle abc which is how much it is student how much it is 64 area of triangle d f is 121 is equal to bc we have to find right bc square divided by e f is how much student 15.4 whole square 15.4 whole square so by cross multiplication c student 64 into 15.4 whole square is equal to bc square into 121 so we have to find bc student bc square is equal to 64 into 15.4 whole square divided by 121 so by applying square root on both sides we can get bc is equal to so square root of 64 is 8 student so we can get here 15.4 divided by square root of 121 is 11 student okay so now it is 11 1s are 11 11 1s are 11 44 11 4s are 44 so 8 into 1.4 we have to multiply so 8 4s are 32 and 2 3 8 1s are 8 plus 3 11 so bc is equal to 11.2 centimeter student so the length of bc is 11.2 centimeters so like this we can solve the problems based upon the areas of similar triangles. So this is very important student definitely you can get a 2 marks question from this area. So that's all today's class student. To get more updates you have to subscribe my channel learn more maths.